in Subnautica today. I have a couple of goals for us. We have a wreck that we're currently parked at that I need to finish exploring that we didn't finish exploring last stream. So that's number one. Then we have a second wreck that we need to go also finish exploring that I marked with a beacon. Hopefully in one of those two things, we'll upgrade our prawn suit because I have a bone to pick with the YouTube comments. Now I got a bone to pick. You keep telling me that my prawn suit would be good if I just went ahead and gave it a grappling arm that I don't have and doesn't exist for me yet. I've never seen one. It's obviously been spoiled about a million times over that it exists. Um, but I can't, I can't just put a grappling arm on Rosie because it doesn't actually exist in my game yet. I gotta go, I gotta go get it. Um, so hopefully we'll find one today and we'll get lucky. And when we have that, I'd love to upgrade Rosie a ton. And I really want to go back to the green underground thing. I really want to go back there. Because last time I was there, Irene could only go to 500 meters. So I really didn't get to like dive in properly. I really want to go back there. I want to build a base there. I'm continuing Bart's research and I require a base in the green area. So that's the plan for today. Oh yeah, I should give you guys a heads up before we start. I have a timer on my phone and every hour I'm going to go stir my spaghetti. I'm sorry in advance. I'm cooking supper during this stream. <laughs> Anyways, we're 17 hours in. Let's hop in. Hello? Where am I? Oh yes, at this wreck. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's use the bulbo tree. Let me be careful. What's in my inventory? I literally forget what I was doing, to be honest. Oh, I do have a full inventory. Goodness. All right, let's put away some materials. I was, when we left last time, I was exploring this wreck. Um, oh, when I got these eggies. Yeah, we need to go back today and get the eggs and put the eggs in. I've decided a couple of things that I haven't shared with you guys yet. First of all, I want my base, the Pride Rock, to be like my, I'm role playing now, okay, I'm Bart. Uh, it's like my marine biology research place, okay? It's got all the plants. It's got like the, the alien containment the eggs and stuff, and then I'm gonna make another base. Then I'm gonna make another base, hopefully in the green, spooky, amazing place. Ooh, thermal vent down there. Um, and that's gonna be like more of a forward base. And I, I'm excited for that. I'm excited for these prospects. All right. Um, today though, all we've gotta do, look at the effects is explore this um, wreck. And we shall do that now. I don't think I actually need all this food on me. Hold on. Um, we can eat that. Also, I don't think we need two first aid kits. I must have picked those up before last time. All right, Sunny, I'm leaving ya. Oh shoot, do I need, who do I have in here? Do I have Irene somewhere? A second, let me actually take Irene out. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Come here. Let's get Irene on the go. I'm hoping today to also get Rosie on the go, but for now, we're getting Irene on the go. All systems online. Okay, so we already explored some of this outdoor area, and we found a way in. I just didn't finish exploring it last stream because I kind of. I don't know what happened. I think last stream, honestly, I just had a headache and I was like, I don't think I can handle a wreck right now. Um, yeah, here we are. Oh, why? Oh, look how cool. Oh, that's fun. I hadn't looked at that before. We open? Things are great, Irene, Rosie, and Sunny. I'm glad you think so. I would agree. I would tend to agree. I think they're great too. Ooh. Okay, I don't actually see anything to scan, but please yell at me, chat, if I do miss something. Oh, we are working. We got our, we got our leg involved in that one. <laughs> Did you guys see that? My like flipper came up. What is this? That looks horrible. Thesis rifle, I already have that. Um, I can actually go up here. 
Okay. I need a laser cutter. I feel like, not gonna lie, that very first wreck that I ever explored was the hardest wreck that I've experienced in this game so far. And I don't think it was because it was my first. I haven't had to go upside down like that since. <laughs> it was horrible. Okay, are you gonna be useful? I can't even scan you. I was so hoping that was gonna be an arm for my suit. Front suit fragment. You're really not a scannable arm? Oh my goodness. But I want one. Cyclops fire suppression system. Well, that seems like that's probably important. Acquired. ARAWN safety instructions appendix A14. Don't climb on or get off equipment while it's moving. Sure, yeah, sure. All right, any day now. We do actually need some oxygen. Maybe I'll go back before I go in here. Hop in Irene for a second. Hang on. Can I get out here? Can't. Nice. Let's go get some air. Perfect break from my exam Thank you, Cryptic Sunflower. Thank you, thank you. Oh. You don't need to be doing that. Go away. Sorry, Irene. They're really rude around here. I will kill you. I will. All right, let's speed back through here. Okay, data box. Oh, titanium. I hate when it does that. All this effort. Uh, supply crate, we got first aid. I don't see anything scannable, chat. And it's a little bit cruel, I think. Six months of awesomeness. Geminite heart, Geminite heart. Cool. All right. <laughs> Thank you for six months. Uh, did I get it all? I guess I did. Man. Still no arm for Rosie. Hold on, let me get my knife out. Three. Where are you, stupid? Stupid, stupid, stupid. Um. You think there's two or three more rooms? see any, but I can have another go around. I don't want to leave here until I got it, that's for sure, because I, then I'd have to come back. It's not very convenient. Anything in here? I want to go deep in this biome, too. Uh, let me just have one more lap. Let me just make sure. Triple check everything. Oh, hey, buddy. Triple check. And room here? Nope, can't go in there. Uh, nothing up there. Nothing up there. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing. Close that door on myself. Don't know why I would want to do that though. Uh, nothing. I don't think there's anything down here. That's where I just came out of. Uh, through here. This is the prawn suit arms that I can't scan. Ooh, is there a way over here? No. Nope. 
going to go with no. Uh, we got the data box. Then we came in here, we got that. And then there's nowhere else. And then you come over here. And you got this. And then there's no vents in here. And then you're back out. I think we got it. Ladder? Was there a ladder? In the last room, of course there was. Where was the last room? Where did I come out? Right here? Ladder? This is the last room. Oh god, this? I need a, uh, I don't have my cannon. I have a stasis rifle. Right, I need to move that, but I don't have my thing. Yeah, I don't have my thing. Where would that go? That would go down here somewhere. Can't crawl in that vent. Just looking for a potentially a different door. Guess I gotta bring my propulsion thing. Should probably just always carry it, to be honest. I should probably. Can I scan you? I should probably put it in my Cyclops. I don't really know why it's not in my Cyclops. I feel like it should definitely be in my Cyclops. But that's okay. I'll see if I got a beacon on me. Hold on. Do I have any in my inventory? No. Go, go back up. <laughs> Look at Sunny. I love it. The Cyclops is so cool. Back up. Uh, I have one beacon left. Gosh, I'm using these like crazy. I suppose I could make more, probably. Uh, put some of those away. And yeah, I definitely don't have my cannon because I'm silly and didn't pack it. Let's harvest some melons. This is probably a good marker anyways for floating, for the islands, the floating islands. Yeah, do. Make a new one? A new propulsion cannon? I will, how easy is it? You know, we could explore that as an option. If it's an easy thing to make. Wiring kit, battery, and titanium. Oh, it is kind of easy to make. It is kind of easy to make. I could, I could do that. I might have the silver. I think a wiring kit needs silver is my problem. And I just don't know if I have silver. Oh, I do have silver. All right, hold on. Let's do it then. What else did I need? Titanium. Gosh. Flamic. I don't know if that's how you say your name. You're so smart. Here we go. <laughs> Mama Bear, thank you for the eight months. Then Ava, happy birthday to Luke. All right, well now I don't need this marker. I'm just gonna mark the biome, cause I've been doing that. Hold on, yeah, I have like, I've been trying. <laughs> I realize my sense of direction is bad and when I realized that I decided to Welcome put a bunch of markers around at landmarks so that I could orientate myself and it's, so far it's working. So that'll just add to that. 
What are you making for dinner? Spaghetti. But I gotta keep going up to stir it. So, um, we got 33 minutes on my timer until I'm gonna go stir it. Uh, over there, please. Man, it is a lot of stuff to have in your inventory, all this. Hey, let me down there. Let me down. Hello, don't mind if I do. Are you gonna turn into titanium? You are. Are you gonna turn into titanium? You are. Good, I'm glad we came here. <laughs> good. Good, I'm glad. I'm glad we did that. That's really, it's really good. It's a really, oh, it's good. It's good. Yeah. This is the power cell charger that we already have. Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm just too good at getting the data things. I get all the repeats. Too good at it, chat. <laughs> okay, that was worth it. Yeah. Nailed it. Well, at least now we have a cannon that we can put in the box. Oh, oh, I might actually... I'm gonna leave the Cyclops right here. It's just a mobile base, and I'm gonna go dive down with them. Um, I'm gonna put this away. And I'm gonna dive down with Irene. Woo! All right, look at these islands. Let's go have a look. Cause I don't think I've poked around much of this. box there. Did I get that already? Oh, now I have nothing on three. Hold on. Hey! Hey! Bed. be a good place. This would be a really cool place to set up a thermal vent base. There's so many of those little sharky guys though and I don't like them. How deep's this go? Whoa. <laughs> so deep. It's thermal, look. Okay, we don't need to go in there. It's all thermal. A year already? Shocked face. Wow. I've been catching your streams more lately, yay. Your streams always brighten my days, especially now that I'm sick, happy, crying face. Oh, thank you for watching. I'm glad that you're having a good time here. <laughs> Wait, oh my god, there's a lot of them. Jeez! Are they attracted to light? Maybe they're attracted to light. And the sonar. God, it's infested! Oh, you're infested! Look at that, he's got the disease! There's a lot of thermal down here. I'm not seeing anything to really pick up, though. Oh, there's something here. Propulsion cannon, good. Propulsion cannon, nice. Okay. This is just a big hole. It's interesting to see the big guys with the disease. I don't think I can go down any of these holes because they're all just fire holes. Oh, 
Look at him, he's sick. I feel bad for him. Gotta heal Irene. No, go away. Okay, well, I didn't see much for me to see down there. I keep poking around. There's a little cave area over here. Uh, looks like an egg in there. Sure, I'll take a creature egg. Don't touch the stingers. I'll also take some diamond. I'm so excited to bring my creature eggs home and see what hatches. Looks like a waterfall. Underwater waterfall. Wow. It's really pretty. I really like this one with the thermal. I'll go on a little adventure down here. Why not? Oh, rubies. Lithium. I love some rubies. Look at that. Coral shell plate. Oh, stupid guy. Oh, that felt very claustrophobic. Scan Ruby. Oh, yeah, I haven't done that yet, have I? I will. The next one. I'll remember eventually. Something there, something small, probably a propulsion arm. No, go away. If I see one of these guys that's sick and is not surrounded by about 30 of its friends, I'll um scan it. Oh. Oh, this is the blood area. I see. I see. I do want to go down in the green area today, but I really want my pawn suit upgrades first. So I guess we're going to the other wreck, because I don't see much here. I don't see any other wreckage. Obvious wreckage, anyway. I love the reef bags. I'm so glad that you're enjoying it. I'm really enjoying playing this game. I feel absolutely no reason to rush anything. Because I like the vibe. I like the environment. I like the building. And obviously I want to see where the story goes. But the sooner I progress through the story, the sooner we're done streaming this. <laughs> and I probably will move on to Below Zero. And maybe then Subnautical 2 will be out. And it'll be fine. But 
yeah, I'm definitely not rushing. Ooh, I got kelp forest there. Where am I? Oh. I accidentally jumped in. Go away. Oh my goodness, Pearl! Thank you for the raid, Pearl! Welcome We're playing aboard, Subnautica. Captain. Oh, is this where we are? What the heck? I realize at no point in this game do I actually know where I am. Like, it's bad. My sense of direction is bad. Welcome, Raiders! We're playing Subnautica. We just started. You're right on time. Hope you had a good stream, Burly. Um, we're gonna go to the other wreck that I had marked today, I think, now. Because I think I've gotten all of this one. And sadly, we've gotten about a million propulsion arms for Rosie, our prawn suit, and absolutely zero grappling arms. No, let me in. Let me in. Thank you. Pearl had a hard time with peer pressure today. Oh, Pearl. What do I actually have on this as well? I just got a fire suppression system. Hmm. I feel like I should also go home. Um, let me save. I feel like I should go home and make some creature decoys because we have this whole system here. We, we actually have it upgraded. Also, people in the YouTube comments were telling me um, these don't stack. So there's no reason to have two of them. Um, but yeah, I think I should make some creature decoys because then we can go close to the creatures. Hatch eggs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do a quick, we'll do a little trip home now for our eggs. Look at our little creature eggs. <laughs> And we have rubies now as well. And I think there was something I needed rubies for to build. Oh, and nickel. I need to go back into the, the, what's it called? I don't know what it's called. The green, the green place to get some nickel. Anyways, for now, oh, let's sleep. Quick nap, quick nap and then we go home. Scan them. Scan the rubies. Yeah, the rubies and the nickel and the everything. I know, I know. Seems so. This game seems so scary for someone who has a fear of the ocean. I imagine it would be. Yeah, yeah. All right. Engine on. Super cool. We just gotta turn ourselves around and find one of our, that's the big old mushroom tree. Nice. We wanna go, oh, we wanna go to Pride Rock, which is like right there. Turn. <laughs> Pivot. All right, and up. Sunny is a uh, sunny is really big. Sunny is uh, quite the sub. <laughs> you need Ruby's first Cyclops step module. Yeah, that's and we also need Rosie's first step module. I think we have both of those. Not a hundred percent sure. Oh dear. Oh, it is so dramatic, but all we have hit is a bladder fish. Yeah. It does sound very dramatic, but I promise it's a bladder fish. I'm excited. I feel like I should almost wait to go in the green area until I can upgrade Rosie. Because <laughs> I have a strange feeling that 900 meters may not do it. But we'll try it to start. Oh, 
Okay, and the next wreck we're going to is this one right here. So we kind of explored over here last time, but there's still a wreck right there that I haven't actually gone into. So that's kind of our next goal. This is so cool. This is so chill. I love it. The Cyclops is awesome. I'm excited to see Pride Rock again. We've been away from home for a little while. Almost there, chat. Almost there. How many fish do you think I've run over? I have no idea. A lot. The number is high. Our home! There it is. Home sweet home. Pride Rock. Alright. Let's park. Sunny. How's our energy? 73. Maybe... Maybe we should take a couple of our power cells and bring them into charge. Just while we're here, because we have other ones that we can switch to. Um, these are batteries, power cells. Turn off the engine, oh yeah, yeah. Somebody in my YouTube comments said the engine doesn't actually drain when it's not moving. But you guys tend to really freak out about that. But also, I'll be honest, the YouTube comments do not do not often agree with the Twitch chat. You guys don't know it, but you're in a constant battle. <laughs> oh, that one's at 100%. That one's at 100%. That one's at 100%. So there's only actually two that were drained. Oh, I missed the notification. Hi, Jen. I'm making Hi, an underworld lady. home in Minecraft. Thinking of you while building. Amazing! I hope you have a great time. We have so many first aid kits. We do not need to be carrying all these on us. Oh, wait, the eggs. Welcome up. Eggs. All systems online. Stationary drains no energy. Yeah, so my YouTube comments are... You guys are kind of... Or my Twitch chat. You guys are kind of dramatic about the batteries. No offense, I love you guys, but they're not actually ready. I'm just picking these for the fire reactor because I'm sure this is getting low. Welcome aboard, Captain. Uh, yep, there we go. And then we can pick up our water, fresh water. Uh, it's nice to come home. Uh, switch out batteries. Charge that battery. And let's go charge our power cells, which I've never done. There we go. Two power cells charging. And go ahead and hatch the eggs. Oh, if you've never been to our base at Pride Rock. This is our safe shallows base. Here we are. We're in we're in the safe area mostly. We're also a little bit in the kelp. Um which we love cuz we get lots of teeth and we have a teeth cupboard. Um uh, and let's put our eggs in. Uh drop 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 drop. Bye, everybody. Enjoy. Please hatch. They kind of all glitched into the ground. I hope that's fine. I hope that's fine. That's probably fine. Um, charger is a power drain. The this. It's going down a little bit. Should we add some solar panels, maybe? It's draining, but not horrible. 
there a limit to the fish tank? I actually have no idea, Romer. Is there a limit to the fish tank? You can make a nuclear reactor, I know. But this feels like the beginner base. I actually, something that I want to do is put materials in Sunny to build new base pieces somewhere else. Somebody said to do that, and I think it's a brilliant idea. Um, which one did they say, though? Do we not have thermal? We have bio and nuclear. I swear we had thermal. Oh, here, exterior, right. Two magnetite. Yeah, we gotta go back to the jelly area for that. Grab some magnetite. Because I feel like if we can get that, we can set up a base when we go down into the, the green area. I'm hoping there's thermal down there. I'm hoping. If not, then maybe it is a good place to do nuclear. The nuclear, we unlocked something to put into the nuclear. I forget what it was called. There was something that you had to build to power the nuclear one. Where was it though? Oh God. Oh, was it this? Reactor rod. Uh, uraninite, lead, titanium, and glass. People in the YouTube comments were also saying that this lasts like forever. Bioreactor with Gelsack Farm. Well, that's what we have right now. We're currently using that. Mm. Okay, that's not too bad to make. And this is also not too bad to make. Plasteel, advanced wiring. We need some more silver, which we don't have a ton of. I don't know if there's anything else that we can, should make in here. Cyclops, I think the Quan suit MK, okay, I don't know if I have the MK1s unlocked for those. Let me go to the bay. Sorry, we, we end up spending the beginning of each stream with me kind of remembering what I have and haven't unlocked <laughs> so that I can then go ahead and craft it. Quan suit MK1, yeah, two ruby, three nickel. That's what we needed the nickel for. Last time we got this, the prawn suit jet jump. We we'll see, you can see here how we don't have that arm that you guys keep wanting me to get. Okay, let's see what our Cyclops has inside of it too that we can potentially also make. Yeah, I think I used all my nickel in the jet upgrade too, Popcap, but I, remember it needing ruby for something. So I just wanna go see this fabricator. Oh, and I was gonna make some creature decoys. Let me pin that. Where would I find the creature decoys? Um, tools, machines, creature decoy. There we go. Um, docking repair, I think we already have. Decoy tube we already have. Depth module, yeah, three rubies. And plasteel, I think I can make that. Never used a creature decoy? Well, lucky for you, you're watching me. You'll get to see one in use. Probably, maybe, potentially. We'll find out. <laughs> Do you have the sonar? I have it for Irene. I don't have the sonar on this. I should maybe get that as well, I guess. Lithium. I should just be crafting this inside. I'm just using my power cell battery in here for no reason. Uh, where'd I put the rest of my rubies? Let's bring some of this inside. Here they are. Rubies. I love my little mushroom plant. It's so cute. Um, and then we needed the advanced wiring kit, or just a wiring kit. Shoot, I don't think I have silver. This 
this is the titanium cupboard. Um, let's put this away. Oh, I need the glass deal. Uh, one less ruby. Yeah, I don't think I have silver. Gotta go get some. Oh, let me take the diamonds out of there. New water. Oh, yeah. Let me eat some melons. for this guy. Sunny, we're gonna let you go deeper. Nice. Let's unpin that and put it over here. Um, Cyclops depth module, 900 meters, perfect. I don't know if we'll actually take this down there to be honest. Um, I imagine we'll usually just park it up top, but maybe I'm wrong. I'm gonna take all of our materials out, except for that. Maybe a couple of those. So I do wanna be able to build stuff. Um, that's all good. That's all good. Admittedly, my cupboards are a little bit full of junk. We're just going to dive at a wreck next. We're not going to be yet. We will, we will, uh, but we're just going to a wreck next. So I'm preparing my cupboards to be filled back up. Finally catching your stream live. Welcome, glad you could be here. We're just um, organizing some things at the moment before we go dive again. Well, that was our now creature deco. I can't make it yet. Don't have silver. All right, well, hopefully we'll get silver soon. I forget where you actually get silver. Mm. Shale, it's not shale. Oh, it's sandstone. Sandstone gives you silver. Okay, well we can be on the lookout for some of that as well. Anything else in here? Waterproof locker. Crash fish egg. Don't really want that. Don't have anything on the radio. Make sure this is doing good. Yeah, the gel sacks actually last super long. Use the scanner room. Oh yeah, for sandstone. I could do, I suppose. I don't know if there's a ton of that around here. I should really upgrade this scanner room. Um, the range. Copper and magnetite. I don't think I have a lot of magnetite. Mm, it's lithium. Haven't been deep in a while. I remember the magnetite was in the jelly area. I need to go back to the jelly area. Let's just see if it finds any. Oh, there's a couple there. Okay, it's looking, it's looking. I'm gonna perk you guys over here and I'm gonna go stir my spaghetti in real life. All right, you just, you guys sit and have a coffee, okay? I'll be right back. You guys knew this was gonna happen. I got spaghetti. I gotta, I gotta stir it. I'll be right back.
you guys enjoy the chair. <laughs> uh, spaghetti smells so good. So ready. <laughs> so I don't know how long you're cooking your spaghetti for. How long? A few hours usually. Beyond, I put it on literally right before stream. And it'll probably have about three hours of simmering. All right, let's hope we get some silver. Oh, right away? Streamer luck. Gold. Lead. At least I let the scanner room run for a long time. Gosh. It's really hard to see these in the grass. Oh, not one there. Mm -hmm. Gold. I have so much gold. I feel like I have too much gold. The sauce is simmering, not the noodles. Good lord, guys. I guess you guys in some places call it, call the sauce something different. The sauce that I'm going to put on the spaghetti pasta um, is simmering. You guys, you guys need me to be really specific. <laughs> the meat sauce. Are you guys crazy? Obviously I didn't mean the noodles, good lord. I can cook. Some context clues, chat. Everything at face value. My gosh, there's so much sandstone. I don't know why here, but we call whatever pasta dish we're having, we call it by the type of pasta. And we never call the sauce anything else. I don't know why. <laughs> we just called what we're making the pasta, even though I'm not cooking the pasta right now. Hey, River. Welcome aboard, Captain. Whoa, I got so much stuff. Let's go. Make your sauce fresh? What do you mean? Like, it's not store-bought, I guess. But I would not have to simmer it for three hours if it was store-bought, I don't think. Yeah, it's a bolognese sauce, I guess, is probably what you'd call it. That's probably what you'd call it. But not me, I'm not going to call it that because nobody in my real life will know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so much silver, let's go. Okay, we got three creature decoys. Let's leave some of our first aid kits here because we don't need that many, it's too many. Turn off the scanner room. Um, and how are our power cells? Oh, they did it! They're charged! Nice. Let's go to sleep. Start a new day. Sleeping at our home. Oh. I love this base. Anybody hatched? Nobody hatched. Next time we come home, we may have some new residents. Ooh, I should uh, change the battery in this guy. Oh, I don't have any batteries on me currently. Hold up. Put that one away. Let's take another full battery. There we go. Thank you. 
Uh, power cells can go in there. Systems online. Let's put the creature decoys in the creature decoy thing. I can fit five. I, three's fine. Three is fine, I think. I don't even know if we're gonna need them, but it's nice to have the option. I guess maybe the other thing that I should have done is potentially the Cyclops fire suppression. Let me pin it. Aerogel is gel sacks, I think. Mm, and Ruby. I think I have stuff for that. I, I don't remember if I have sulfur, but I mean, if we can make this, we may as well. The music when the Cyclops catches fire is lit so don't even want to put the fire in. Oh my gosh. I need to turn my music up. Somebody did say that. I could turn it up a little bit. Where is it? We'll, we'll go to 20. Let's save again. Um, and let's see if we have sulfur. Or what was it? This is sulfur. What am I looking for? Crystalline sulfur. I have one. I need two. Do I have two? Come on. I know I was down in that green that green river. I know I was down there. And I know there was sulfur down there. Surely I picked up more than one of them. I didn't. I didn't pick up more than one of them. Nice of me to pick up one, though, I guess. Ah, oh, put that back on three. Shall we have a little bulbo tree snack before we go? Use most of it on the jet upgrade. Oh, right, I did do that. Nice. Well, that's okay, because I have big plans to go back there today. First thing, though, we're gonna go to that wreck. We're gonna go to that wreck. That wreck, right there. Shouldn't be hard. I think we can do that without needing a fire suppression system. All right, Sunny. Let's go. Engine powering up. Love Subnautica. So happy you're playing it. I'm so happy you're playing it too. I'm loving it. It's such a lovely game. Now, I marked this wreck over here because at the time I was specifically looking for the Cyclops engine fragment and I decided not to go in the wreck. Um, but obviously, I do want to go in the wreck, so let's go back and see what I missed, basically. It's actually not that far away. Oh, spade fish egg discovered. You guys can't see that because it's saying it in the corner under my webcam, but my eggs are hatching. This is weirdly not very far away. It should be like just over this kelp forest. I didn't realize it was so close. Whoops. Did I hit? Yeah, it should be down here. Really? This is not where I remember it being. Well, maybe it is. I mean, it is a big, it's kind of a big crevasse. Oh yeah, no, here's the spooky stuff. I see. Here we are. Alright, alright, alright. Easy. Really hard to see how close we are to that. <laughs> We're fine. Hi, Gem and Chat. Not deep. 
Hello, Cliff Thomas. Thank you for the 17 months. Thank you, thank you. I hope you're enjoying our adventures in this game. I can do all that. And all right, Irene, are you ready? Bam. Oh, I should have turned the lights off. Oh, uh, systems I online. That looks like drill arms. Yeah, I already have this. Turn off engine. I know, but it, it's probably fine, right? It's probably fine that it's not off. All right, I'll go. I'm going. I'm gonna leave the external lights on. All right. Engine, power engine off. off. We're at full battery. All right, let's explore this whole area way more thoroughly because I was kind of lazy when I was looking for um, just specifically the Cyclops stuff. I love these. It may be one of my favorite plants. Hi, Pickles. I don't know how long I'm streaming for, to be honest, but I will m probably also be streaming fast mode tonight. If I'm not streaming it, then Impensk is will. Um, so you get a lot of gem today. But I'm taking a break to eat my spaghetti sauce and cook some noodles for my spaghetti. <laughs> soon enough later on um more drill arm fragments already opened that <gasps> ruby oh scan scan look i had the scanner in my hand and i did it i did the thing that i was supposed to do what's it gonna say about it not a whole lot is this gonna be another drill arm it is Goodness. Another drill arm. It's crazy. There's a lot of sandstone here, too. I mean, we are kind of out here to resource gather as well, so. Let's do it. Gotta go in the actual wreck too. Machine, machine parts random. I think people in my comments have been saying that they are a little bit random. I don't know what a little bit random means, but a little bit random is the answer that I have for you. It's my first playthrough, so I don't know. <laughs> Personally, uh, seems random to me. It's because I've only played once. I don't think I can get through there. Oh, I can get through right there. Don't mind if I do. Hello? What do you got for me? Twisty turny? Ooh, yeah. Very twisty turny. Ooh, laser cutter. Oh, my inventory is so full. Why did I do this to myself? I should have stopped off first. I'll open this and then I might stop off to uh, drop off. I really hope I have time today to go to the Green River again. It's all I want to do. Let's go down. What is all this? So this goes out. Mm, that has nothing for me. Okay, I think it's just that laser cutter spot. Let me go up first and get rid of some of the stuff in my inventory. Hey, Sunny. How do 
go in. Right here. Um, here we go. Much better. God, I really hope there's some good upgrades in this wreck. I need it. I need it. Alright, through here. Oh, another door. What's this? <gasps> this is what we need! Yes! Oh, thank God. We do need two of them. Please give me two. <laughs> thank goodness. Rosie is finally going to get to see the light of day. Actually, Rosie may still not get to see the light of day because I think Rosie's going down, not up. But Rosie will get to see the ocean. And the horrors of it. It'll be great. And where'd I come from? Up there? No, right there. So I didn't go up here yet. Oh. That's a box. Hello? Nope. Uh, that turned to nothing, right? Oh, is this another one? Grappling arm fragment. Yeah. Oh, thank God. That is literally the main thing that we needed. Duh. I think all we had to do was come into this rack. I am so happy about that. Is this even more? Oh my gosh. There's so many. I'm not going to scan them all. We, uh, it's fine. Well, I will. Integrate new PDA data. New PDA data. What did I get just then? Data downloads, public documents. Was it this? Torgal Corp. Okay. These plans were put on hold when the Bart, Bart Torgal intended leader of the new mining operation disappeared along with his father roughly a decade ago. Okay, just some, some lower. Let's go out. Can I leave? Can. Uh, did I get everything important? Because now what I want to do is go to the vehicle upgrades and pin that. Benzene, lithium, advanced wiring kit. I think I can do all of that. Where's advanced wiring kit? <laughs> I know it's silver. I don't remember what else it is. Gold and computer chip. Okay, I think all of that is really doable. We can make that, chat. We can do it. We can make it. Did I get it all? Do you think that I've explored this? My bad. Where's my beacon? I'll be taking you. Should I mark something here? I feel like I should mark that this is this biome. Ooh. It's a ruby. Oh. It's really warm there. All right, what do we got? Let's mark it. This. No, no, that's not what I wanted to do. And it, no. I get it, hang on. You, you give me a second, you stop bobbing up and down. Yeah. Um. Uh -huh. That'll at least tell me where that is. Oh, where's Sunny? <laughs> All right, Irene, this might be your last day out. 
mean, we're still gonna use you for some stuff, but Rosie's about to have a big moment. Captain. Systems online. Nice. Change the battery again. Change the battery and flashlight. I'll go home and charge those now in a second. Turn that on. Um, put this down here. Gosh, I'm so excited. I think we have stuff for benzene already. Yeah, because it's just the blood oil. Okay. Okay, this is doable. Let's do it. Let's go home to Rosie. Engine powering up. Nice. Up we go. Got to turn around. Entrance to Blood Gator, spooky alien thing. Big old mushroom tree, Blood River, <laughs> floating islands. That's the only normal one I've got. Guess I should have came up with a name for them. Pride Rock. I love just hovering over all my beacons. This is a good idea though. I should have started on the beacons a little earlier to mark like all the little things. All right, well, I'll just coast along the top back to Pride Rock. Are you sure you have blood gel? Yeah, 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 positive. Because I am taking inspiration from Bart and I have a beautiful garden going here on Pride Rock that is growing all of the things that you could possibly imagine ever needing without having to go get them. It's amazing. Miss Wilfred, thank you for the tier one sub, by the way. How's our power doing? 97, we're all good. LCG! <laughs> thank you for gifting 20! Thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> it's so many. It is so many. This is crazy. Thank you, thank you. Somebody told me that this was the amount of noise that I'm making as well. And if I'm making a lot of noise, it attracts things. So that's good to know. Sunny, let's get you down a little bit so that Rosie has an easier time getting in. All right, engine off. Nobody panic. Um, now, what do I want to have on me? I feel like I should just bring a bunch of this in again. I'm gonna need the silver to be fair. There we go. Yeah, this will be fine. It'd be worth changing Rosie's beacon color to red. I think Rosie's a different color on the beacon. Or maybe Rosie's not. Oh yeah, because I haven't really used Rosie yet. There you go, Rosie. All right, let's pop Irene out of here. I love Irene though. It's gonna be hard to get used to using a new vehicle. I kind of love Irene. Welcome aboard, Captain. This is gonna be crazy. Oh, look at the window now. Look at Sunny! <laughs> I took a screenshot. That is cool. That is a cool view. I love this base so much. <laughs> it's so epic. Um, let's eat something while we're here as well. Oh, inventory full. Correct. That's correct. Put away some stuff. Oh, I need some silver. What hatched? Oh yeah, let me look. Okay, so we got a cuttlefish, which we knew. We already have one outside as well. Oh, we got a jelly guy! Look at the jelly guy! Those are my favorite ones! And we got um, a speed fish. Who else did we get? We 
We got a jelly guy. That's the most important guy, I think. I'm gonna leave that cuttlefish in because we already have a cuttlefish outside. We haven't said, oh, it's a shark. I got a little baby shark. Cute. Oh, I love the jelly. I want a whole aquarium of those. They're my favorite. <laughs> it is a baby shark. It is a baby shark, Jen. It is. Look, my new plants all grew as well. These look really pretty. I'm really glad that I grew them. I think I can grow even more in there. <laughs> you guys are driving Romer insane. Oh no. <laughs> okay, let's uh, eat. And go get our oil from inside. See, we got oil. Look at us go. Uh, do, how many do we need? Just the one. Uh, we'll take water. Don't actually really need all this water, but it's good to have. We are going probably on a longer adventure next time, so maybe I should take some. Take lots with me. Okay, benzene. Wiring kit, two gold and a computer chip. Two table coral, gold, copper wire. Gold. Table coral, I gotta go get. Kinda wish I could grow this. Scan your shark? I think I've scanned a shark. I feel like I've scanned a shark. It's possible I haven't, I suppose. I haven't scanned the sick one. But I think I've scanned everybody in here. Everybody's been scanned. Where is the shark? There you are. Oh no, you haven't been scanned. Here you go. Oh, where does it keep going? Got it. Boat shark. Avoid, may be distracted by light sources. Distracted by light sources. So I should turn off my lights probably when around them. That's probably why I attracted so many. Two gold. <laughs> Two gold. Well, luckily I have lots of gold. There we go. And then we just need a lithium. Throw some flares. Oh, that's what the flares are for. That's useful to know, actually, because those guys are really annoying. Oh, and now I need to go make that down here. Rosie, you're getting an upgrade. Grappling arm. And last stream, we also upgraded Rosie. We got the jet jump thing. So Rosie's like mega upgraded right now. Get another arm. Okay, we got drill arm. We got jet jump. Do we need anything else? Somebody said I could put the storage module that I took out in Rosie. And I feel like I should do that. Uh, depth module, I need more nickel to get. So maybe we'll get some of that today. I don't think I can get kyanite yet. Okay, so it's just this, which we need nickel for. Um, let's unpin. Unpin that. So I have on screen right now the next two recipes that I want to work towards. 
do all three remaining as storage. Yeah, I have storage. I forget where I put it. They must be on Bunny. Let me go see. I'm so excited to try it out. Power cells. There's a storage module. Got one. The rest must be... I feel like I don't need to be carrying that around on here. What's my timer doing? Good. Sonar in Sunny. Oh yeah, I was gonna work on that as well. I think it's fine for right now though. Um, we don't need that. that away. Let's put the rubies away. Oh, not a battery. Let's actually charge these batteries. Nope. They're all partially dead. Um, I'll take the full ones. Nice. Do you know your coordinates? No. Not a clue. Don't even know if there's a way to get that. <laughs> Hi, Nelly. Um, I'm just trying to think that there's not anything else I need to take with me on this journey. Storage. How big is this storage? Are there like multiple storage things on Rosie like there were on Irene? F1 shows cords and biome. Oh, cool. Um, just looking for the rest of those storage modules. I don't actually know where they are. Let's take some water and a nutrient bar. Better, better safe than sorry, I guess. Uh, otherwise, though, I think we're good to go. I love my little fish tank. And my random beeper. Oh, two random beepers now. Good. Good news. Oval tree's still growing. Oh, it's a melon. There we go. Where are we going? Um. Good question. We're going down. We're going to um, Blood River. Blood River. We want to find the Green River again. We can also find our, where's our cuddle? Where's our cuddly guy out here? He's our cuddly guy out here. Hey buddy. Hi buddy, you wanna snack? Oh, cute. <laughs> Alright, I feel better now. Let's go get Rosie. Alright, Rosie! You are brand new! Oh, man. Okay, this is gonna take some getting used to. Okay, there's the grappling arm, and this is the drill arm. And I also have the jet jump. Wait, how do I... How do I use the jet? jump. Oh, and if I click? No. So then I can hold? Hold here? Whoa. Jumping feels way better than it did before. That's for sure. It's not even going down at all. And there it goes. Then I... This is going to take some getting used to, chat. <laughs> Borkian is a Winnie Bork. Winnie's working. It's getting close to Winnie's supper time, and she's a Labrador Retriever. Tests every day to make sure she's not going to get a 3 o'clock supper instead of a 4 o'clock supper. She just... She makes sure every day. 
Just checking. Alright. I want to put another first aid potentially in the prawn suit. Should I potentially also put a power cell in the prawn suit? Um, just to charge it. I just want to be super prepared. That and that. What time is it here? It's three o'clock. She barked at almost exactly three o'clock. She can tell time. She doesn't get fed at three o'clock. She gets fed breakfast and then she gets fed supper. <laughs> But she, she's just checking to make sure that I, t today I wasn't going to decide to do an early supper. <laughs> um, okay, I don't know if that marker actually leads to the Green River. Oh, should I actually bring more beacons? I should. I didn't... Oh. Um, how do you make a beacon again? It's just copper and titanium, I think. Copper and titanium. I should make another one of those just because it's a good idea to have. Don't know if I actually have any copper in here though. Yeah, don't. Let's go get some copper. I just like having a couple of beacons on me because they've been really useful. And I use them all. And I might find something cool Welcome underground. You never know. You never know where we're going. It could be cool. I might want to find it again. <laughs> All right. Now I'm ready. Time is fast, though. Mm, usually in two and a half hours from now. I may be a little later than that, though, because I gotta eat supper. All right, Sunny. Sunny and Rosie. No Irene. I'm scared, but let's go do it. I don't know how deep into this today we'll get because we're already an hour and 30 in and my dog's already barking. Um, but we'll see. I'm excited. I may have to pause at some point to stir the spaghetti again. Sorry in advance. I'm very sad that we're leaving Irene at home. I was really getting used to Irene and being able to like maneuver and I'm not very good at maneuvering in Rosie Blood River the question marks are because I wasn't sure if this was actually gonna lead to it or not. Oh, they're beautiful. I see the warpers in the distance already. Yeah, this is gonna be horrible. This is gonna be horrible. I'm excited though. It's been a while since we've been deep. Oh, I, shoot, I didn't bring the things to build a base down here. That's one of the things that I really wanna do. I really wanna, if I find it, I wanna build a base. Now, are we good? We're good. Where are we at? Not very deep. Oh yeah, there it is, right there. I was actually, whoop. 
What's coming towards me? Oh, it's you. I don't have any defenses on this except the creature decoy. Who goes slow? I think slow. Does that reduce our noise? Gary can't see anything. Smager, thank you for the raid. Where am I? Oh, there's my beacon down there. Right, this is probably good. We could probably drop out here. Hi, raiders. I'm doing very stressful things in my Cyclops and Subnautica. <laughs> Welcome. Benji. Powering down. Um, turn off those, turn on those. Does the creatures leave this alone if I park it here? That wasn't a correct sentence. Do the creatures leave it alone if I park it here? No. Depends on the creature. Hmm. Well, I don't want this to get destroyed while I'm down there. As long as the engine is off, yes, you guys are very... You don't seem very sure. <laughs> Scott, I hope you had a good stream. We are doing some very intense um, about to go deep in this game called Subnautica. And I'm very excited. Big Sunny down. Did you wallpaper your office? I wallpapered it, but I haven't painted it yet. I'm so lazy, Scott. I'm so lazy when it comes to this. Engine powering up. Making noise again. We're going slow. See down. Whoa. I think that was just fish. But it is hard to get this thing to go where I want. I want to be closer to this wall so that I can grappling my way up. <laughs> Stupid fish. Okay. This goes deep. This is probably a good place, a better place to park. Cool. This is a better place to park. Nice and tucked Engine in here. Powering down. Yeah. We how deep were we? 325, so not very deep. But I'm hoping this leads me down there. And then Rosie can just come back up. We can come back up with Rosie to meet it. Can go deep. I know it can go deep. But I've never been down there. And driving this thing down there is stressing me out. Because it's so giant. It's huge. It's big. <laughs> How do I get it down there? My driving skills are just not that good. No, I want to go. I want to go look. God, you can really. Goodness. Get a lot out of a bulbo tree. Let's drop Rosie here. I think Rosie is what is our what we do here. Everything's gonna be off. Nothing's gonna attack us. The engine's off, right? Engine's off? Yeah. All right. Beacons are in inventory. Batteries are in inventory. Stasis rifles in inventory. We have stuff. 
to feed us. Save. We're saving. Thank you. Oh, we're just falling into... Yeah. I mean, that's fine. That's probably good. Oh, but we found it! That was easy! Oh. I do... Oh, wait. I don't like that we can't swim freely. I, I was enjoying being able to swim freely. And, and now we are on the ground. We are grounded. Okay. Where, what, is, does Rosie have lights? Oh, look how pretty! Ah, I'm really bad at this thing. Can I walk in this with Rosie? Uh, I think the answer is yes. <laughs> it's so nice. What is this? Silver ore. Dude. I probably shouldn't fill my inventory with this, but I know I can get more, but um, I want to save inventory space. I don't necessarily need silver. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Okay, if we find a thermal vent, we're gonna mark it and we're gonna make a base there. Alternatively, if we find a really nice spot, we also just might make a base in the middle of nowhere and use the, what is it called? Nuclear reactor? What's this one? Lead. Oh! Okay. Yikes. Sure. Sure enough. <laughs> but he's so pretty, look. Look at him! He's so pretty! That's why I want a base down here, because I want to be able to hang out with him. Oh, there's some crystalline sulfur here, which I do need. Is it safe to get out? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to grapple you. I meant to drill you. That's my bad. We've got to come back this way anyway. We'll get the sulfur on the way out. Hi. What's that noise? Where does this go? Oh my gosh. We're already at 700. I don't even know if we can go down there. Because I can only go to 900. I need a depth module. Again! <laughs> I need nickel. If I can get nickel, which I think I can get down here, actually. If I see nickel... If I make a base here, I can make a scanner room, and I can scan for nickel. And then it'll be great. Is that nickel? Let me out. Cool, cool, cool. Magnetite. Nice. Super nice. I like that guy. Hmm. 
This feels like maybe back out. I'm just circling the edge because I think it'll be the easiest way for me to find my way back to that hole if that is indeed where I need to go. Who are you? Hey, Ski and you. You're really pretty. I'm a really big fan. Ghost Ray. Don't hurt me. Inedible is the assessment. Poison flesh. Cool. Sorry, sorry. Crystalline sulfur anywhere? I mean, there we go. Why oh, hear so many angry? So it tells me I can't drill that guy. I'm leaving. Don't you worry about a thing. I'm just going this way. Yeah, you just, you hang out over there. I'll hang out over here. Everything's okay. Everything's fine. This is your home. I'll just, I'll be up here. That's a really big guy. And he keeps screaming. He seems really upset. Hey, are you really upset? All right, we're going down the hole now. Weirdly, it seemed safer. <laughs> Trusted you, chat, that this was not going to be more than 500 meters. This is gorgeous. It's so deep, though. I can't go more. I can only go 100 meters more down. Oh, thermal! That's what I need. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. This is deep. What the heck is this place? Oh, look, there's structure over there. Oh, we could put a base here. 58 degrees Celsius. Oh. This is cool. Can I get out? Will it kill me? The temperature, I mean. Beak it. Yeah. Um, edit beacon name. What am I going to call this? No, let's call it something where I know where we are. Green River Thermal. Oh, dog bork. This is cool. I'm nervous that we're like right at depth. I really need to work on picking up some more nickel <laughs> while I'm down here. So then I can go deeper when I come down again. I need to keep an eye out for that. Let me just scan these walls. See if there's any nickel. Nickel? This is shale. Quartz. Nickel. <laughs> it's so pretty! How deep is this? 860. So we're still good. Uh, oh, it's hot. Don't know 
Why? Oh, I was standing next to that. Okay. Oh. Um. Asad, thank you for the prime. Let me save. I may have to go stir my spaghetti again soon. Hold on. My spaghetti sauce. Not the noodles. The noodles are not cooking right now. Just, just to clarify. There is a nickel on the wall. Is that nickel? Right above Rosie. Am I losing my mind? Where? I see Ruby. Uh, I see Shale. Nickel is hard to see. Fish. Above on the roof. What the heck? How is my character breathing down here? There's a diamond. I think we need to make a base down here. I think that's what's needed. This is where I would like my next base to be. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Okay. So there's something in the middle. Um, and then there's obviously a structure over here. So let's go look at the structure. I will take a screenshot. I will. I will do that. Lead. A nickel, huh? Titanium? Lead again? Look at this! Dude. Screenshot. Oh, big guy. Warper guy. some titanium and get started on the base already. I don't have my habitat builder. I don't. But I I will be coming. I'll be going back up to Sunny and that's where my habitat builder is. Oh my gosh. This alien structure appears to have collapsed to the sea floor. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Yeah. It does appear to have done that. That's correct. Jeez. Oh, no, 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 no. No, I don't want anything to do with you. Is there a door? Maybe up there. I didn't, um... Detecting an alien broadcast. Linguistic analysis reads, caution, hazardous materials and life forms contained within. Oh. Interior walls in this section are substantially reinforced, indicating the designers were seeking either to keep something out or contain it within. Whatever their intention, it clearly failed. Oh. Clearly. Oh, I didn't bring a tablet! guy. Ooh. It's an egg. 
Sea dragon egg is what that said. Are these bones? Rib cage. Display case containing an array of rib cages harvested from the indigenous life forms. There is a particular focus in this instant on vertebrae skeletal structures. While some of these skeletons match organisms encountered on the planet so far, most cannot be matched with confidence, suggesting either that there are species out there not yet accounted for, or that we have become that they have become extinct since these samples were collected. Can I have it? Oh. Ray specimens. Ray specimens on four five four six B. Okay, different species of ray indigenous to 4546B each adapted to different environments. The spe specimens are 99.99% .99 genetically identical to those encountered in plant on the planet today, suggesting that the rays in particular have undergone little evolutionary mutation in the past millennium. Oh boy. Well, some of the rays have stayed within the limits of the cave system where they first evolve, others relatively more recent adaptations to new environments, likely the results of overpopulation. They're herbivores. Oh. Integrating new PDA data. Leviathan detected at facility perimeter closing at high speed. Exterior anchor cable impacted with massive force. Exterior anchor system buckling. Facility sinking. Collision with seafloor. Breaches detect in containment unit 7. Leviathan eggs. Immediate specimen destruction protocol initiated. 314 specimens destroyed. One specimen unaccounted for. Evacuating staff to offsite sanctuaries. Planetary quarantine protocol initiated. Warning infected individuals may not leave the planet. This is interesting. It's very weird because thus far we've been like all of the things that live here, we've just, I've just assumed that they are the aliens, but this is. A facility, that's a big fish. It's a facility that's specifically studying the things that lives here, as, as though there's something like humans kind of here. Where's Rosie? Let me go get her. Um, because this reminds me of the Degasi base now that it's in English <laughs> translated. That they're like studying the thing. So I guess this is the disease? Kind of started here. Something broke loose. Assuming it's a sea dragon. Um, because we have an egg here. That said sea dragon on it when I scanned it. Um, what are you? Skeletal remains. Remains of research specimen. It's interesting that the aliens are researching the things on the planet as though they are not also from here. <laughs> Although I guess humans do that with Earth, so that does make sense. Habitat. The environment constructed to house this specimen suggests it was kept alive in containment for research purposes for years, even months. So this was a containment place. Organic matter indicates the habitat once supported extensive plant life, though it has since decayed when the facility collapsed. This specimen either was either left to die or killed on the spot. While it suggests, while it shares some skeletal traits with the biter and sand shark, including its distinctive double eye sockets, this fossilized specimen is significantly larger and features unusual forearms rarely seen in aquatic species. This species ha has likely gone extinct in the past thousand years. Okay, and I missed the sea dragon egg. This large egg is held in a hermetically, how do you say that? Doesn't matter, sealed environment and has been chemically sterilized. Without the means at the facility to house a full grown sea dragon, it is possible the aliens sought to study. Instead, the egg laying in 
Oh, okay. So they decided not to hatch it. Look at the arms! The little T-Rex guy. So this was like a giant aquarium. Now I'm just in here. That's a piece of skeleton. Residual biological evidence suggests indigenous life forms were brought to this location and subjected to intensive study. Worker parts. The organic parts on display contain DNA from dozens of different organisms, largely originating off-world. They are in varying states of augmentation with advanced technology. This production line setup suggests these self-warping constructs were built, maintained, and deployed by aliens that designed this facility. Worker. Self-warping quarantine enforcer unit. This life form shows signs of heavy genetic modification and extensive mechanical grafting. Its digestive and pulmonary systems have been replaced by onboard battery receiving energy directly from the main grid and distribu distributing it around the body. Uh, miniaturizing, miniaturized phase technology has been implanted beneath the skin and is triggered by a central nervous system, allowing the construct to teleport at will. The brain and central nervous system have been digitally augmented with advanced processing power and remote communication assessment programmable hunter killer. Avoid. That is cool. Look at this. Dude. Oh. This is so cool. So they were making warpers here. Huh. Very, very, very weird and cool. Let me go back to Rosie to breathe. This is interesting. I'll go back in there, chat, in a second. I'll save. <laughs> this is so cool. Okay, I want to keep exploring, um, but I got to stir my spaghetti again. IRL problems. Retreat block. Pausing, because I can't unpause and sit you in a chair here. Hold on, chat. I'll be right back, I promise. How was your chair stream time, chat? <laughs> All right, back in. This is so interesting. So interesting. Less than three gem is the greatest. Data pertaining to the bacterium is being downloaded. Caution. Detecting atypical fluctuations in blood plasma proteins. A self-scan is strongly advised. Self-scan complete. Bacterial infection has spread to the skin and pulmonary system. Medical report recorded to date to bank. It is imperative you find a way to neutralize the infection. Whoa. I 
I'm dying. That's not good. That's not good. I don't want to die. Bacterial infection report. Uh, immune system is currently combating the infection at low efficacy. You may already be experiencing flu-like symptoms and skin irritation. These will likely ex be exacerbated as the bacterium sets hold. Your immediate priority should be eradication of the infection. Recommended steps. Salvage further alien research data on possible vaccine. Investigate the mechanisms which have enabled the indigenous ecosystem to inhibit the symptoms of infection. Okay. Uh, Kahara contagion profile. This terminal contains extensive data regarding the bacterial contagion identified as Kara. Uh, discovery. First encountered during routine network expansion on outer worlds. Pandemic development network error resulted in routine quarantine procedure failure. Contagion was uploaded to and spread quickly through the core worlds. Confirmed death, 143 billion individuals. Uh, attached to healthy living cells and mutates the basic genetic structure. Stage one is gradual immune system failure, green skin and lesions. Stage three, unpredictable alterations to biological structure. Stage four, complete shutdown of executive function. Emergency steps taken. Core worlds quarantined, bacterial samples distributed to isolate disease research facilities for vaccine development. Treatment procedure unknown. Well, darn. Okay. Well, I hope somebody around here lived long enough to think about a vaccine, because I don't know a lot about my character, but I don't think we're smart enough for that. This is cool. This is really cool. It's that glass. I like this glass. Oh, that was a ion cube. So I need to bring a tablet here, which I have in Sunny. Need to bring a tablet. Should I just mark it with a, a beacon real quick? I can easily pick it up again after. Um, I think I can find this without this beacon, but... Um... Alright. Oh no, I didn't mean to open. Alright, so we need a purple tablet brought down here. I suppose that could be the next priority, and also base building supplies. We'll just build where the, ra where the aliens built. Hey, Warper. They constructed you. On purpose. I don't know why they do that. No, leave me alone. secret. I know you're not real. You're no better than a robot. This is cool. Stop screaming. Everybody screams in this game. Oh, stop getting stuck on the things. Leviathan skeletal remains. This is huge. Sea dragon skeleton. Semi-intact skeletal structure of Leviathan class predator. Achieved fighter Rosie status. 
Thank you for the biddies. Thank you, thank you. Head trauma and age. Approximate decade, thousand years ago. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Quartz. Lead. This is cool. We gotta go back up and see that uh, really angry guy soon, unfortunately. Read it? Read this out loud? What it just says about trauma. There is clear evidence of a massive, massive physical trauma to the head. The damage is so severe it was likely the cause of death and must have occurred somewhere nearby. The damage is consistent with a high-speed collision with a solid object. Age, something in the environment has helped preserve these remains, but calcium decay suggests an approximate time of death of 1,000 years ago. Bone growth suggests the creature was in the egg-laying stage of its life cycle. Right. Right, there's my other beacon. Is there really no nickel here? I'm gonna go back up. Yeah, the facility has the egg. That's so sad! That is so sad. Obviously, there's more to see down here, and I know I do know that, but <laughs> we need a purple tablet, and I want to make a base here. Priorities and stuff. And also, I'm not 100% sure how I'm going to get us back up here. Rach. Yeah. Okay, we've got a bit of story. It's honestly a lot to take in. Um, and then just letting my jump refresh. I, I am enjoying the lore. I figure I had a grappling hook eventually. Okay, it's my first day with it. I'm not very efficient yet, but we're doing it. Gosh, we're doing it. Oh, I really need some nickel. Is that nickel? It's nickel! Yes! There's a big scary guy up here, and I'm gonna need him to leave me alone while I look for nickel. Is this nickel? Oh, I think this is nickel. Thank goodness we got four. Right. Now we can go deeper. For now, let's get out of here alive. Because there's a guy down here that likes to scream at us. We gotta go back to Sunny. I'm so glad I didn't bring Sunny down here. Actually, I think it's nice having a checkpoint further up. This is gonna be a long journey up though. Up and down. It's kind of weird being glued to the ground. I'm so used to Irene. I keep getting stuck on stuff. Forget the sulfur. Oh yeah, I need one more. I don't really need that right now though. Sunny will be all right. What's this one? Silver. This is the way out, I think. This is exactly the spot where I came with 
Irene. Gosh, I'm really bad at jumping. Okay, I hope Sunny's okay. Oh yeah, there's Sunny. Gosh, I really dropped us right over this. Hey, Sunny, catch! Are you gonna catch? Please catch. No, you're not gonna catch. <laughs> Sunny did not catch. We'll just charge up for a second. Alright, Sunny, catch this time, okay? Catch. C catch. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Welcome up. Thank you. Systems online. Thank you, thank you. Internal light. Oh, it's much nicer here in the daytime. Much nicer. Um, I don't... Can I craft? I don't think I can craft the... This is just for Cyclops, yeah. So I have to go home to craft the depth thing <laughs> for the bronze suit. So then he can go way deeper. I know. I'm just a wimp. Um, and what else do I need? I want the I want the base build down there. Build a base with a moon pool? Yeah, what's a moon pool I'll need? <laughs> see titanium ingot lubricant and lead okay i'm gonna pin that i also want an observatory to look at everything um and i guess we'll do thermal we just need the aerogel which i think i can make yeah, aerogel was rubies, which we have at home in gel sacks. So we can have a thermal base. And when the, we can bring the tablet back down when I come with base stuff. So we can do both at once. And a scanner room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, what's a scanner room need? Uh, table coral. Gold. All right, so we just got to make sure that Sunny here is filled with that stuff. Isn't there something you can do against the slowly dying thing? Oh, I'm sure there is. I'm sure it's a very important story beat that we're gonna cure ourselves. Um, but at the moment, I'm gonna make a pretty base in the pretty area because I don't actually think we'll die. <laughs> I think we're okay. This is such a cool area. All right, let's back out of this then and build a base in the pretty area. We've got all the stuff we got, and we'll make at the same time that we go home, we'll make sure that Rosie can go a bit deeper so that next time we're not stopped by anything at all. We go. Very cool. We're just gonna go all the way up. This area is actually really easy to get to. Ingredients for another fabricator too. True. Right, secondary base incoming. It'll just be really basic today. I'm really hoping I can get it done before supper. I have like a half hour before I absolutely have to go. I don't know if I've got time. I don't know, chat. Oh. If I go a bit faster, we might have time. Is that another vent? Oh yeah, I think I was already at that one. That is another vent. Look at all the peepers around it. 
so interesting. It's fine. Collect resources on the way. I think we have the resources, or we can have them at Pride Rock. Are we streaming Phasma today or just playing? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll see how I feel. How much energy I have left in me. Psychops health is full. It may sound really dramatic when I hit fish, but it's actually not that bad to the health. For a hatch and tubes too, and maybe foundation stuff. Yeah, I think I can get quartz down there, right? For windows and stuff. We'll definitely need to bring some teeth. Okay, this is going well. I feel like I have a lot to digest when it comes to the new lore that we learned. About the hunting warpers. And the bacteria disease that we have. Bring a seed to grow creep vines. Oh yeah, I should do. That's a good idea. Could grow some inside. And there were titanium lumps down there. Oh, I forgot I turned it off while I'm here. Powering down. Um, so we can get a lot of titanium down there. I think. Um, we'll grab some of these and we'll put them in sunny to grow. Perfect. I will need the table coral. I'm just going to take it all though so that I know exactly what I have. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Oh, that's the teeth. Uh, we have a magnetite now, too. What do we need that for? I already forget. There was something. Thermal thing. All right, it's literally on screen right now. Okay, two of those. And then the aerogel was a ruby and a gel sack, I think. Ruby and a gel sacks are outside. everything for thermal reactor. Let's bring it over. Do I have a lubricant on me? I feel like I made lubricant at some point. Oh my goodness. I do that so often. Uh, I think. Lubricant. Um, and let's make another ingot. Looking at the moon pool ingredients now. And two lead. The tool's already on Sunny. Okay, I need a locker that has nothing in it. That'll do. Two lead, three, four, five of those, two of those, two of those, that and that. That should be the moon pool and the thermal in here, 
Right. Two lead, two, two, and lubricant. And then five, two magnetite, and aerogel. Yeah, this is a moon pool and a thermal plant ready to go. Um, this is stuff, let's leave, let's get a bunch of table coral next. Bunch of coral. I think that's just going to be titanium. Um, foundation is titanium and lead. Mm. Titanium and lead. Lithium. Table coral. Bullshin. All right, so that is uh, moon pool done, thermal plant done. I uh, just need gold and copper. We'll take some extra lithium. Take some extra gold. Take some extra lead. Um, well, I mean, we'll definitely take extra titanium. Take extra silicone, maybe. Let's make some quartz into glass and then enamel glass just from here. Copper is kind of a limiting resource right now. I don't have enough copper. Okay, let's put all this stuff on board. Uh, in here is fine. Bunch of enamel glass. I think we can get quartz down there. What the heck was that? Cyclops depth. I guess we were gonna make fire suppression too, which we could do now. Change out battery. We're definitely not gonna have all the things on this trip. Um, but it'll be a good start. I think we have enough for the scanner room now other than copper, which for some reason I don't have very much copper on me. Yeah, basically no copper. And what did a fabricator require? <laughs> Um, interior modules. Table coral, gold. Okay, I brought extra gold for sure. I can bring a little more. And I brought extra table coral, and then it's just titanium. Copper is the next thing. So, let's look for some limestone chunks again. Bring kitty poster? No. We're still gonna come back here. I don't plan on this being like a new permanent base and it will never come back to Pride Rock. Like Pride Rock is still home. We have tablets in Sunny already. Uh, let's see. Vehicle mod station for the moon pool, true. 
That's probably a good idea. A gel sack is probably a good idea too. Although I think I saw some down there. Do you have stuff for the nuclear reactor? I'm doing a thermal. Seeds I can already get on Sunny. Oh my gosh. Come on, give me copper. You don't like thermal reactors, but there's thermal vents down there. I thought they'd be great. I've never tried them, I've never played the game before. I'm just doing the stuff that the game's got to offer. Where are all these limestone chunks? Is that four? Not very much copper. <laughs> One more copper. Copper, that's pretty good. All right, I think that's everything for a new scanner room. Well, Obviously, copper. we're gonna want like the upgrades and stuff for it. I'm a little nervous for that, but hopefully it'll be enough. Um, a couple things there. Let's go turn off our scanner room. And I haven't made the depth Welcome thing yet. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, thank you. The depth thing was the nickel that I brought back. And plasteel, which is going to be lithium and titanium. Okay, that's enough of you. Thank you. Probably want transmitters. I don't know how far away I'm going to be. I've, I plan on kind of being on top of a vent. I try it, and if it doesn't work, I'll make some then. It's okay. It doesn't have to be like maximum efficiency. We might be back and forth a few times. There's the depth module. I swear I turned off the scanner. Did I turn it off? Front soup depth module. What's the goal of this base? Uh, to be pretty. And to make me happy. Uh, what, where is, what was the next one? Sea moth, cyclops, prawn suit. Kyanite. I actually don't know how to make kyanite yet. It, has it shown up on my fabricator? Mm, nope. It has not. I can't make it yet. Interesting. There's more to unlock. I'm excited. That means I need to go deeper. Six 
access upgrades, depth. 1300 meters, okay, that'll make me a lot less nervous, I think, I'm excited for that. Um, and let's just make sure my habitat builder's in here. It might be inside. Was I building inside? Shoot. Does anybody see a habitat builder? Maybe not. All right, locker. I thought that's where it was, but I don't think it is. Oh no, it is, you're right. Copcat's always right. It's a rule in this chat. <laughs> Sunny's max depth upgraded. I've upgraded Sunny's once. I think we can go with this. Now, don't get me wrong. It will be painful. We'll be turning around about a million times and coming back and, and going back and forth. But I think we're good for now. Teeth. Yeah, I mean, I brought some enamel glass. That'll be good for now. It doesn't have to be pretty on the first pass. We'll add some glass and stuff to it next time. Now, back to the Blood River. Where are my other beacons, actually, that I put underground? Down. Tablet? There's tablets in here. Lots of tablets. Nobody panic. Chat's official charter is the panic, I know. It's one of my favorite comments in the, U in the YouTube comments is talking, because the YouTube commenters can read the chat that's under my webcam, and they all, they're always talking about how you guys are freaking out. <laughs> but I think it's easier to freak out when you're watching it live and you know that you can, you have the power to change a decision, whereas the YouTube commenters have, have given in to the fact that they are just watching. They, they cannot change my decisions now. <laughs> it's interesting to see the back and forth. see me. You don't see me. We fit here? Yeah, we fit. Chat said to go lower, so this is us going lower. Uh. This is the big hole, right? Yeah, this is the big hole. We're we clear of everything. Ho, ho, ho. All right, Sunny. Down you go, buddy. You leave me alone. No, you're not going to, are you? Let's 
Oh, that looks kind of like we're not going to fit. Maybe. Forward. This way. This way. Rig for silent. No, not well. that. Where's my tail? I don't think we're hitting anything. God, it's gonna be awful to get out of here. Oh, did I hit something that time? Now I'm hitting something. All right, I think we're. This is where we stop. Engine powering down. Music's kind of cool. Yeah, I mean we're good here. Um, I guess it's daytime. We sleep. Fill Rosie's inventory. Ah, yes, we shall. Is Sunny damaged enough that I should repair? Hold on, let me look. Oh no! I was a good driver! Not actually damaged at all. Totally fine. Okay, I feel like the creep vine is not immediately needed. This stuff is immediately needed. Uh, and a purple tablet as well. Open storage. Nice. Rosie has so much space. Mm. Couple of those. Oh, I actually don't think I needed that silver for anything. Needed a purple tablet. Uh, that one's empty. A little more copper. A little more gold, lithium, enamel glass. Yeah, yeah. And the habitat builder's on me. It is. Okay, we're full. And my inventory is full, so now I can't eat. <laughs> Shoot. I'll drink that. That'd be fine. Should take one extra water with me, though. Right, Rosie, we're going back down. Dropping you into the void. Sunny could get down here. Uh, the problem is there's the big there's a big guy down here that screams. And I don't know if I want Sunny involved in that. Oh the lights. Alright, the lights. Fine, chat. Is it actually gonna matter? Like worst case scenario, it drains a battery and I put the new power cell in it. It's not that bad. I don't think it matters. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. You guys have chronic anxiety. I love you, but. <laughs> Leave me alone. All right, to the alien warper factory. Still gold and copper. Oh my gosh, nice. This place is so cool. I 
My problem is I want my base down by the thermal vents for power is what I thought originally, but I also want to see the big guy that's here. I don't know. We can always just deconstruct where we build and reconstruct if I think of a better spot that I'd rather. doesn't scare me. A, a lot of people were, um, I think, telling me that this part would be scary, but I'm not, I don't have any fear of water, or deep water, or depth, or heights. So this part is fine for the, for me, in this game. Um, now where exactly do I want to be? This makes you anxious? Yeah. I can see how it could if you have those fears that I just listed. Okay, so there's rivers there. the skeleton of the mama. And this is the blue over here. Look at the rays. They're so pretty. I'm glad there was an entry about them. Ollie. <laughs> Ollie could have made that sound effect. Oh, look how sick this is! It looks so good! How deep are we? Oh my gosh. It's gorgeous! But there's no thermal. How far does thermal travel? Whoa. And we're below 900 meters. This is officially the deepest we've ever been. Oh my gosh. I'm just taking all the screenshots. This is gorgeous. Big tree. Giant cove tree. A vast tree encountered in a deep cove and the only one of its kind encountered on the planet. The tree is surrounded by rays grazing on its pink outer leaves. The bark is hardy, fast growing bark, uh, ghost leviathan eggs. The tree's branches are wrapped around a number of maturing eggs belonging to the species designated ghost leviathan. This tree appears to be an ancient nesting ground. The eggs were laid when the tree was young and now the branches protect and grow them. These? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 
Okay. This is crazy. I don't see thermal. <laughs> if I want a base here, I gotta power it with something else. Oh, there's thermal right there. Okay, never mind. I do see thermal. Okay, why did I untab those things? Because now I need to see what the thermal thing needs again so that I can get it all in my inventory. Pin recipe and it's exterior. Thermal is just gold, or the power transmitter is just gold and titanium, which I brought extra gold, so that should also be fine. Uh, habitat builder can now go on three. Let's make a start on this. Um, I need two magnetite and my aerogel. So how does it go. Like, does it have to be... Oh. I see. Oh, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. So does that now give me power? If I build here? Uh, lubricant, titanium ingot, and lead. It looks funny. I know, it looks, does look a little stupid. I'll give it that for sure. Okay. And now, it looks like we can continue that way. So we want a spot here where Rosie can get into. Maybe like bridging this gap. No, okay, I don't want it to have one leg because that looks silly. Oh, there. See if that's close enough. We have one strength. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, now we can unpin and unpin lithium and titanium. Let's grab that so we can reinforce to give us a little bit more um, flexibility here. It's a little bit closer. Is it not powered here? I can build a, um, a thing that reaches. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. A little closer. I guess I would have to build it where Rosie actually is. I could just build an extender. It's just gold and titanium. I don't hate that location, so. Um, gold and titanium. I don't remember what I brought the gold down here for, but. So how does this work? Does it go up here? Is this? Or does it have to go over there? It goes over here. Oh. How? Oh god, I'm dying. Halfway? Right. So I'll just build a little tube. Um, and then build it. Let me hear. Blue line is range. I didn't see a blue line, not gonna lie. Try again and look this time. A blue line. Where? 
<laughs> that... Oh, right there! Okay, so it needs to be here. Alright. But I can't just put it on the ground, can I? No, I can. Okay, go there. Hey! Nailed it. <laughs> All primary systems online. Power restored. Welcome to Old Captain. Come here, Rosie. We're getting, making a new home in here. Yeah, first try, basically. Okay. We have oxygen down here. Um, now I want to have a glass area, obviously. And a scanner room. Just need to get the titanium out. Scanner room was, like, most important, really. Open storage. It's the last of my titanium, but we can go we can go mine some more. Um, how much do I need for the scanner room? Five. And how much do I have on me? More than five. If if I can, I'd like to put it like off of a tube. And a tube takes two. Do it right here. And then a scanner room. There's a ton of titanium in here. I figured, yeah. I can look around for more stuff. Okay, my base strength's not great now, but um, we have like the basis of a second location now what we got to do is we got to reinforce more and i want a ton of windows and stuff don't need the tube i know to be honest i put the tube mostly so that i can put a multi tube like i kind of put the wrong tube i kind of needed one of these it's okay i'll redo it later i definitely want windows which means i need glass which means i need a fabricator down here which means i need the guy i need everything i need so many things titanium gold okay i used all my titanium so we gotta go get some This is so good, though. We need all the windows. But we can get quartz down here. We can use the cameras now, right? And there won't be little stalkers coming to get us. Woo! Look at me. I can go explore ahead of my base. Like, no risk. What's the max range on these? Do you guys know? You've got me hooked on this game. I play it on my Switch. I'm not as far Whoa. as you. I'm still looking for the Cyclops parts. You're playing it on your Switch? Amazing, Rose. I hope you're having a fantastic time. Whoa. You guys said so many different numbers. I'm past 200, so some of you are wrong. Whoa. Cool. There's just so many jelly rays. There's nothing dangerous right here. I'm sure there is somewhere, but... Where does this go? Oh, it's turning red. And there's a warper. Do they affect my camera? Okay. Well, this looks like an entrance to hell. There's a infected guy there. Whoa. Huh. 
<laughs> Very cool. Yeah, we're a kilometer deep officially. And it looks like it goes even deeper. Wow. Look at all the stuff we can scan for as well. We couldn't scan for all this at our old one because heat area. Wow. We just scan for titanium. Very cool. Very cool to have a base down here. I'm gonna need more water and food soon. I gotta go back to Sunny. We are far away from Sunny right now. We have 250 power right now, which is not bad. How long will you stream? I actually need to be done. I need to be done streaming. I'm gonna go get a little more titanium for next stream, and I'll probably end the stream at our new base. I mean, it's got power and stuff. Can I go down here? Yeah, yeah. So much titanium. We can add another thermal thing on the other side too if we wanted to. We don't we're not restricted to one thermal thing. got a lot to build in this new location and I want it to look prettier and be more functional and stuff but for now I think I'm gonna save and I'm gonna call it here this was a amazing stream we made so much progress it's unbelievable actually so happy I will be on for Phasmo on Imp and Skiz's channels and maybe this one maybe I'll see I'll it's, we'll see how I feel but for now I'm gonna call it here. I'm gonna save again, just to really just make sure. <laughs> this was amazing. Thank you for hanging out, everybody, while we play the video game. Um, and now we gotta find someone to raid.